Hello everyone, I'm Moog and welcome to the first ever speed paint that I have done as a VTuber. And of a VTuber, I guess. <laughs> um, this, as you can probably tell, is fan art of Takanashi Kiara from Hololive English. Uh, and it is fan art of her in Byleth's outfit from Fire Emblem Free Houses. Uh, the reason I decided to draw her in this outfit uh, was because when I kind of got, really got into Hololive EN, uh, one of the first things I watched pretty consistently uh, was Kiara's Fire Emblem streams and I really enjoyed them so I decided to do this fan art. I got into Hololive, uh, I think it was kind of late last year, but I've been kind of a fan of VTubers since the kind of OG Kuzna I days. <laughs> But yeah, to explain a bit more about uh, the actual process of the art, as I've mentioned in other videos, I got an iPad for Christmas, uh, so I drew this on Procreate. Uh, I think, if I recall correctly, this uh, I drew this back in December, but I think it is one of the first kind of fully coloured pieces I did on Procreate. Uh, I'm still getting used to it, and I'm still kind of figuring out what brushes I like on it. So it's kind of, there's a little bit of a learning curve there, I think, but I think it is going well. Uh, I'm a big fan of the uh, fact that it automatically makes speed paints for you because there are so many times where I forget when I draw on my computer, oh, I could be recording this for a video. <laughs> uh, and then it becomes, you know, it's too late or I just forget to do it. But with this, I can just draw and it will do it for me and it is very convenient. So expect a lot of Procreate videos in the future. Uh, but I'll try and do some others uh, because obviously with this you can only see it from one viewpoint but I'll try and record manually as well so you can get bits of like seeing it closer and stuff like that. Yeah, I this is the first time, as I mentioned before, that I've done any VTuber or specifically Hololive fan art and um, I really like the uh, Hololive fan art community, especially on Twitter. Uh, it seems really nice. It's a good change of pace, really, because uh, there's been a, there have been a lot of other fandoms where doing fan art in them is kind of intimidating. <laughs> um, it's not necessarily that people are mean, it's just... Uh, I don't know, there's kind of a high standard in a lot of them. Uh, whereas the Holy Life fan art community is very chill, and I like that. Um, and also, you know, I don't want to, I don't want to flex or anything, but, um, <laughs> Kiara actually liked my tweet of the time-lapse video of this, so that made me very happy. <laughs> you know, the first Hololive uh, fan art I do when I, you know, I get noticed. Oh my god. <laughs> um, and I think that, uh, you know, as a lot of you probably know, uh, VTubing has gotten really big recently, or at least has become really big in the English-speaking community. Uh, I think that Hololive EN was definitely a big driving factor for that, and that's something that I do uh, really admire all of them for. Uh, I think that all of the Hololive EN members are uh, really hard workers, and they're really like pioneering for, for you know everyone that uh, does this uh, in the West, and I think that's really cool to see. Uh, obviously, like I said, it's kind of why I'm doing this right now. Um, it's also good that I think in general, again, in the English speaking uh, side of things, VTubing has become a lot more accessible uh, in the past few months. I think that that's definitely a positive thing. You know, people can learn how to make Vroid models because, you know, it's a free program. Uh, and it's, I mean, there is the fact that it's a little bit hard if, um, you know, you want to make like a live 2D model or something because you either have to learn that or pay a lot of money for it. But, you know, there's definitely uh, options for people with a lower budget. Uh, I have a lower budget and um, I got a model made for me for a decently good price. Uh, I got good graphics and you know there's a lot of free programs now for VTubing like for facial capture and such so I think that there's definitely 
it definitely has become a lot more accessible to a lot of people and I think that that's definitely a positive thing and hopefully we will see more of that in the future um, anyway <laughs> about the art about the art uh, this is really fun um, I really like using Procreate and I, I think I've kind of been deciding more stuff about my art style lately and I definitely like using the kind of bold black lines. I know a lot of people like to have coloured lines. But this is just the style I like. I also like playing around with colour a lot and I think that one of my favourite things about drawing this was colouring the hair because I really like Inkiada's design that kind of the blends of oranges and blues in her hair. That was really fun to draw. And I really like her eye colour as well. It's super pretty, right? <laughs> anyway, I don't want to ramble too much about this, so... Um, depending on how fast this speed paint is, there may be a bit more of it before the video actually finishes. Uh, or this might just be the end of the video. I don't know, as I record this, I don't know how these things go. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope that you've enjoyed. Uh, feel free to follow me on Twitter and such for more updates on these things. And, uh... I suppose I'll see you whenever I next see you. Bye!